Got a replay here between Lamb Sauce King and Lasaurus. Empire versus the forces of Kislev. Kislev taking a lot of their buffed cavalry with the Glorious Charge. So we'll see what they do there. Wonder what kind of caster that is. It's an Ice Witch, obviously. I'm not an idiot, but Tempest. Swiftwing and Hailstorm for the spells. Okay. Oh, yeah, Lasaurus is telling me a bit about Swiftwing. 40% more charge bonus, plus the Glorious Charge, giving them double uh, duration on their charge bonus. Okay, cool. Four Wing Lancers, one Griffin Legion, two Cossars with Spears, two Streltsy, and then five Armored Cossars for a front line is the basics of the Kislev build. The other side for the Empire, we have four Empire Knights, Hammer the Witch's Great Cannon, some Spearmen, Spearmen and Swordsmen front line. We do have an Empire Captain standing around, hold the line, and then a bunch of Huntsmen and Ballstar get with Plague of Rust and Searing Doom. In comes the Glorious Charge, Swift Wing upgraded. And they come in here, get some decent damage down on impact, but they're charging uphill and they get countercharged by Empire Knights. And these other Wing Lancers are not doing too great against Empire Knights. Again, the Spearmen nearby and an uphill charge not really going their way. These guys are still running around the back line trying to disrupt all these Huntsmen. Meanwhile, over here, we have two Empire Knights versus two Winged Lancers. Empire Spear support nearby and Huntsmen firing over the top. Appears to be tough for the Kislevite Cavalry. Now we will see what Kislev can do with their front line getting here now that a lot of the Empire's front line is on the flanks helping out against the Winged Lancers. So far, though, I'd rather be the Empire in this situation that just happened. Uh, their Empire Knights are holding up very well against the Winged Lancers. And the Griffin Legion, who are now Plague of Rust overcasted, while Huntsman try and pursue them down. And, uh, Hammer the Witches is trying to shoot at stuff. It is at an awkward angle, though, because it's like shooting over a hill and then down into a pit. So he's not having the best time, poor Hammer the Witches. Wing Lancer is going to rout as Empire Knights hold firm. Gelt throws a Searing Doom on himself to get rid of some Cossars with spears. They kind of try to dodge it, so they get most of the way out of the way. The Empire backline, most of it is still online and shooting and doing really good damage to these Winged Lancers, but uh, some of it got disrupted by a suicide charge in from these guys. Looks like they got one Huntsman fully, another one half HP. Hailstorm's going to hit a, fight, a third Huntsman over here while the Griffin Legion continue to fight against Empire Knights, but uh, the combined arms of the Empire is outdoing the glorious charge of Kislev right now. Empire is up on the balance of power, and these Winged Lancers are still having issues getting off of this hillside getting onto the flats where they can get really good charges. One Empire Knight is routing but not being chased off, so it will rally in a second. The other Empire Knight is getting recharged by Winged Lancers, and they might rout, but the Huntsmen are just firing in for free right now, doing so much damage to those Winged Lancers. Streltsy get up onto the high ground and have attack orders onto the Hammer of the Witches. Hammer of the Witches currently shattering the Griffin Legion. And the Streltsy not getting to fire before the Empire Captain blocks them up for now. Huntsmen still counter-firing, and the man, the Huntsmen have taken out a lot of the enemy cavalry this game. These are the ones that got disrupted. The ones that haven't been disrupted. 400 value, 650 value. Okay, so I guess, like, not crazy values yet, but they're, they're doing okay. Hammer the Witches refocusing. Looks like they're trying to shoot at any winged lancers that come in. Meanwhile, the Streltsy are getting wrecked in melee by the Empire Captain and getting shot over the top by Huntsmen. And the Empire State Troops are holding. I think Armored Cossars are beating them in the 1v1s, but there's just so many State Troops, they're holding Kislev at bay. Huntsmen turn fire at the Winged Lancers, whose Bire Blood has been popped already, so they will just rout instead of getting that. There they go. Do have some pistols firing uphill. Cossars with spears fighting Empire Knights on the low ground. It is a shame to see two Order factions that should be best buddies at odds with each other, but the Huntsmen are doing much better at this uneven terrain, firing up and over into these, oof, overcasted Plague of Rust and the Armor Cossars gives them 20 armor. Still Silver Shields, but 20 armor is rough. Anyway, the pistols aren't having such a good time on this uneven terrain. As we get a Swift Wing down for some Streltsy and Armored Cossars. Unfortunately, they're not using their charge bonus right now, they are using their pistols. Just to shoot at the Hammer of the Witches and get some decent little damage there. Balance Power is tipping further and further into the Empire's favor. As Gelt lands on the Ice Switch of Tempest while she is surrounded by Huntsmen. Just trying to beat up on her. A little Hailstorm will do some good damage. Well, the Hammer of the Witches is ignoring all the pistols getting shot at it. Instead, turns towards the Ice Witch. Though it doesn't look like they can see past Gelt very well. To be honest. 
And Kislev is doing okay in the infantry department. They are starting to push through the Empire front line. I'm getting a little concerned as Streltsy and Pistols shoot Balthazar Galt in the back. Quick searing doom. Does a little bit of damage to him. Just a little bit. Huntsman firing in. If Galt will get back into the sky, the Ice Witcher Tempest will move away and everything is fine. Meanwhile, Empire Knights are going to get a charge onto her. Never mind. She could probably run away. They're all the same speed, so I don't know. Streltsy and Pistols continue to poke away Balthazar Galt, but he is very quick and he is very small. Hammer the Witch's routes off. We are getting some Empire Knights and Spearmen back, but their HP and uh, leadership bars are not convincing. There's going to be a lot to do here. Quick Hailstorm. Hurts the Empire Knights a little bit while Streltsy in the distance are firing in onto those Empire Knights. Going to try and route them away from the Ice Witch as she is surrounded, but they go to negative six leadership and they do route away from her. And the counter steering doom from Gelt takes care of some armored Cossars, but. Uh, Kislev can be spooky in the late game with all these armored Cossars against wounded-ass spearmen. I mean, look at how healthy some of these armored Cossars are. Empire Knights try and charge the loosely scattered armored Cossars. We'll get a bit of damage on the charge, and then hopefully can pull all the way through and get to safety. Huntsmen are trying to kite these guys out, and the Hammer of the Witch's crew actually goes into melee to just poke and uh, prod at these Cossars <laughs> with their little swords. No armor, they're just doing their best. Empire Captain still fighting with Armored Cossars, who are still trying to use their pistols to counter fire against Huntsmen. Probably have to focus on going into melee as much as possible, to be honest. Searing Doom onto more Armored Cossars. Hit some Spearmen. A little bit of friendly fire, but overall fine. Another Hailstorm pokes down Huntsmen. Really not doing that much damage, though, to the Huntsmen. TBH. Armored Cossars moving up. Gelt's trying to peel for his Huntsmen. And they're still firing up and over these hills before the armored Cossars can really get in range with their pistols and fire back. Coming down to the wire a bit between these two armies, both very low, and the armored Cossars continue to march on. Empire Knights are going to charge up into a stump, and they accidentally brain themselves in that stump, and now they are in. Can the Cossars fight back briefly with their axes and push off these annoying Empire Knights and get some safety here? Hailstorm on one side versus a Searing Doom on the other. Both sides taking some damage, but it is the Armored Cossars who take the worst of it, because they were at two-thirds HP, now they're down to one-third. Just like that. Kislev's falling further behind as all over the board their troops start to rout, leaving just the Ice Witch of Tempest and this Armored Cossar. The Huntsmen still pretty healthy, still doing a lot of damage, have enough ammunition to finish out this fight. It looks like the Huntsmen are really proving to be the winners of this game. The Huntsmen in general have been seen doing really well right now. People are talking about War Wagons all the time, but I think if War Wagons get nerfed, the Empire will still be pretty top tier as a faction, just off the back of how effective their roster is, especially the Huntsmen and the Empire Knights and stuff. Looks like the game will end on these two spells. Searing Doom should finish off the Armored Cossars and end the hopes of Kislev where they stand as a Hailstorm does very little to the Huntsman, kind of proving how this game has gone so far as the Huntsman just tank through all the spells. Armored Cossars stop and shoot pistol shots at Gelt. One des uh, desperate temp attempt to lower the Empire leadership, snipe out the enemy caster and Lord and uh, take the game from there, but it doesn't look like it's gonna be enough. As the Kislevites just get shot by Huntsman and state troops stand triumphant. Another hailstorm is out. Gelt and the Empire Captain try and chase down this lady. I don't know, man. I don't know what Kislev can do at this point. They got nothing. The Empire doesn't have a lot, but they have more than nothing. Gelt's still trying to chase down the Ice Witch of Tempest. Having a tough time actually catching her, but now she's stuck in spears. And Gelt is behind her, but was it all a bait? Was it all a trap? Armored Cossars firing across the ravine with their pistols, but another Searing Doom tries to take them out. Good dodge here by Kislev, tries to get out of the way. Dodges a lot of the damage and holds for now. Huntsmen are running out of ammo and just turning into melee troops, but the Armored Cossars will to fight breaks. One of them shatters, the other one just breaks normally, and this one with one volley left is going to shoot the Empire Captain, who is still above half HP. The Ice Witch is getting ground down by Spears. A downhill charge to the Empire Captain will seal the deal on her. Though he did miss his first attack, he should hit the second one. Gelt chases off some armored Cossars, Hammer the Witches is back online, and Army losses hits. GG. For Lamb Sauce, 1100 on Gelt, 300 on the Hammer of the Witches. Empire Knights did okay at blocking out the Wing Lancers, but it was the Huntsman show all game long. Pretty good value on them. State Troops also did quite well. For Lasaurus, his Ice Witch did okay. 
His Winged Lancers and Griffin Legion got largely shut down by the Empire very effectively. His Streltsy and Armored Cossars tried to carry the game, but it was not enough. Rawr. Subscribe, yes, yes.